Hello everyone, this video I will show you this E16S board and work with the Ethernet cable and for the web server that use the HTTP command. You can see I can use this web browser to turn on and turn off the array. Just click button for on and for off. So this can also turn on all array that is for all array is on and all off and uh, turn on every different relay so that will be easy to integrate to the third part of software so this time we have used the ethernet last video we have used the wi-fi but the ethernet will be very stable and also this part will support the menu country button you can see here i can click on and off by the button so that i can connect with this uh, switch panel the switch panel is dry contact signal just to connect with this terminal and uh, to this terminal and uh, i have used this uh, button on the board just for testing so if the panel is broken or the board is broken or the ethernet is broken so you can also use this button to turn on and turn off the relay okay this is the function of the web server but how to use this freeware you can see here we can so upload the source code and the freeware on the form of E16S. So you can download this zip file. And unzip this zip file, you will find and this is freeware and this is source code. I think you just directly to use just use this bin file. So also you can download this ESP32 download tool. So this can download from our website and this file and after you download you will see this package you can just click and choose this chip type is esp32 and press ok and here the first line you can input uh, your path of your freeware uh, just you can see here you input the path of the freeware and must input the address at this number so as you can see here we have note uh, this address and this path and now you just connect with the usb cable with your pc i can connect with it and you can see which com part you have used you can see the device manage in windows and here we can see I have used COM3 so I just click and choose COM3 and just click start then it will begin to download so just uh, three steps the first step input uh, this path of your freeware and the second input the address and the third just choose the COM point and then just click the start then we begin to download after the complete download you just need to power on or press this reset button so let's wait for a moment okay now you can see it's finished when finished you can remove this usb cable and press this reset button here reset button you can press and you can see the network cable LED will be blink and wait for a moment because now we have configured this board uh, the network with the DHCP so you can check in your load and you can check uh, this we have used this IP address that have a WT32 ETH01 that is our E16S board so you just fill this IP address uh, to the web border and uh, like this and enter then you will see uh, this terminal and you can just click on and uh, for off and here you can see this is our Arduino code this is another file is Arduino code you can see here that have the code the default is DHCP if you want to set the static IP so you can see you just copy and paste this code uh, just for your IP address for your gateway for your DNS so you can just copy uh, this code 
and uh, paste it here. You just copy and paste it here. And the last, just uncomment. You can see here, you just let uh, this command enable. So you can see here, have a note if you have static IP address, you just let this command enable. So if you want to use the DHCP, you just uncomment. So that will not use the static IP. So this will be very easy. Just uh, choose a static or DHCP. Okay, this is for network setting. And maybe if you will ask me if the network is broken, whether the command uh, can control by this uh, menu control button. So you can see here, I can click on and off. But this time, I have removed this network cable. The cable is broken or the network is broken. So you can see I can also turn on and turn off uh, this button, different button for on and for off. So this is work in locally for the menu control button. So that will be safety uh, for the board. And if you have connect with the table ag again, so you can use the web wire again. So this is for local network country and for the network country for the ESP32 for the E16S board. That can use the HTTP command for the web server. Okay, thanks for watching.